The European Union's climate service is delivering a stark warning. 2024 will almost certainly be the hottest year on record. Humanity is torching the planet and paying the price. This NASA model shows global surface temperatures climbing since the 90s. And a new report predicts this will be the first year that's 1.5 degrees warmer than the pre-industrial average before human-caused emissions started spiking dramatically. We're seeing the, the beginning of the world truly breaching the 1.5 C temperature threshold. And, and to see the consequences for sea level rise and ice and people and disasters. A state that he narrowly lost four years ago. For some, the election of Donald Trump is adding to the anxiety. The next US president once called global warming a scam. It was a ripoff of the United States. And I ended it because I didn't want to waste that money. That's what he said about the Paris Climate Agreement, a deal centered around staving off the worst impacts of climate change. Trump pulled the U.S. out, Joe Biden rejoined, but Trump has said he will roll back climate measures again. Having a federal climate legislation is very important. It was for quite, quite transformational. And Anand Gopal and his climate policy think tank modeled the potential impact of Trump's second term on U.S. climate action. He says to expect emissions to continue to drop, but significantly slower, with consequences on the environment and the economy. 180 clean energy projects have been started up in the U.S. That is quite a significant number in just two years. As the world's second largest emitter, uncertainty over U.S. climate action will likely cast a shadow over the U.N. climate change conference in Azerbaijan next week, as countries wonder what path the new administration will take. In Ayat Singh, CBC News, Toronto.